And you can catch the next episode of Vets Safari on Wednesday, 8.30pm on BBC One. Time now for Lazy Brunch with our guest chef, Bryn Williams, and our new kitchen boy, Gareth Gates. <laughs> Gareth, so are you much of a, a cook yourself at home? I, I'm all right, I suppose. Uh, I like to cook sort of northern dishes. Northern dishes. I'll ask you a bit more about that Lunch in a second. Hot pot. Yeah. Hot, exactly. <laughs> Toad in the yeah. hole. Is that Toad nice? Toad in the hole. Lunch hot one of my favourites. Really? really? Is. Yummy. And it's great, yeah. Really what are you good. making now for us, Bryn? It's a, a lazy brunch. Very, very simple. Very, very fast. Um, we're going to do pancakes, then we're going to roll them in creme fraiche smoked salmon. So it's like a, a sushi of smoked salmon with some lettuce leaves. That's it. Lovely. Really, really simple. If you like smoked salmon, it's a real bit of a hangover cure, really. You know, if you want a pancake, it takes, what, five, ten minutes to make. Easy. So first and foremost, we're going to flour in a bowl, mm -hmm. in with the eggs. Then we're going we're gonna to beat the eggs into the flour and add the milk. But we're going to let this rest for about, I don't know, at least 20 minutes after before we cook it. Why is that then? Because as you whisk it all together now, you create air bubbles. And you want the air to come down. If you had a lot of air bubbles in it, the pancakes would rise. So you want a nice thin nice pancake. Thin. Right. So it's flat. So you good at making breakfast in bed for your lovely lady? Um, no. No? <laughs> Honestly. She's got to get you a bit more trained, I think, than that. She's fine with the cornflakes. So Gareth. Nice bacon butty. No, I'm joking. Yeah, I like a, a, a big old fry up on a morning, yeah. Yeah, especially on a Sunday morning. It's a yeah. bit too healthy for you then, isn't it? Well, a bit slightly, too, yeah. Slightly too healthy. So, that's the pancake mix done. We're just going to lay it in the fridge. Just let it Pop rest. it in the fridge. Yeah. Nice. And here we have one that's already rested for a good 20 minutes. You see the difference? It's quite still. Yeah. yeah. There's not a lot of movement there. So, into a, a nice non stick pan. A little bit of olive oil. You need a little bit, even though it's a non-stick. Why is that? Otherwise, it just will stick. That's yeah. where I've been going wrong. It will. Yeah. See? It's just that Thank little... Disaster. Literally, <laughs> teaspoon. That's it. You don't want any more than that. So, in the pancake mix, make sure you give it a good mix. Yummy. This is going to be nice. Look at these. Here. Nice and got some thin. Already. Nice and thin. That's the secret. It's a nice thin pancake. Mm. Into a nice warm pan. Always add a little bit first. Then you can always add to it. And that is it. Nice. So you can can you still do the whole like tossing them in the air and you can like if you that, really want to if you're yeah. bored you can do it yeah but, not, uh, very good, that is not very good really so that's you must be able to do pancakes surely no yeah, you must have done pancakes I, I don't Easy. make pancakes yeah but I um I often buy the uh, pancake mix which makes things oh, come on. easier look how uh, easy sorry, it was sorry equal it's amounts thin. of flour egg flour and milk that's okay. it if you weigh it all or you could, if you measure in a jug, flour, egg, milk, that's it. Equal quantities, okay. great. That's a good tip, thank you. Know, you. Thank what's your knife skills like, seeing you buy pancake mix? Well, I don't know. Well, it looks very like sharp, it's though. big it's, as well. We need sharp knives. Sharp knives are the key, because right. if it's a blunt knife, you're always quite willing to, to cut yourself. So a sharp knife is the key. Can you cut them as fine as you can? You can, can do see? it better than I can. A little demo. Last so week I nearly chopped my What is the way to chop? Because you, know, you see people go like that, and I don't really know. The tip of the knife should always be on the board, right? And you always use the heel, use the back. Okay. Okay. Oh, you have okay. to roll it, not press down. Do so you roll that's it. A good, that's a good action, isn't it? Yeah. Watch it out. Look at that. See, there's going to be no excuse for you not getting in that kitchen now. Roll it is the. Roll it is it's not, just, not just pressing down. Because as you, if, if you press down, you bruise it. You, you, you know, you just go straight through. As you roll through, you get a, a better movement. I prefer good, to huh? use a slightly smaller knife personally. Like you know when you were teaching oh, wow. Sarah to get the vanilla yeah. pod, that was just oh. such a huge knife with such a little tiny. <laughs> maybe that thing. maybe that was a knife a little bit too big for the vanilla, but for this it's, it's fantastic because you can have long movements with it. Mine's rubbish. <laughs> You're nearly there, nearly Not there. Bad. Okay, let's roll these pancakes up. So should we give Gareth a give a, Gareth a pancake? His fingers. Yep, yeah, lovely. It's a nice okay. pancake for With you. a palette knife, we're just gonna spread the pancake with the creme fraiche. So just a nice even coating, dig in, up yourself. Uh, how, mu how much of this? Just spread it, uh, the same thick as, as the, as, yeah, a little bit Bring more. Bring it to you, because then it doesn't get... Oh, go on. <laughs> oh, okay. cool. Is that enough? Go on, you can always add, yeah, go on, put it on. You can always add more. A bit like butter, a little bit thicker you can put your butter. Okay. Mmm, so can you use any other ingredients for this to put inside the pancake? I suppose you could put ham if you really wanted to. Still with the creme yeah. fraiche? You could put creme fraiche, or you yeah. could put more of, a, more of a cheesy kind of creme fraiche That's into it. That's a good it. idea. Stick a little bit more into it. That's it. Yummy. Look at that. And then you're going to roll it up. We're going to roll like it up like a sushi. And cut it. The next thing we're going to do, we're going to season it with, with pepper. Just sprinkle over the top. We're not going to put any salt into this because smoked salmon can be salty sometimes. You can always look at him. And you have it over there. Look at that, you see. <laughs> you see a little bit of uh, chopped chives onto it. So what um, other things do you I like have to have a little bit of yours. Mine's a bit thick, I think. 
Oh, he's not impressed okay. with this child. Thank you. So what else okay. do you like cooking, Gareth? Um, what we're doing now, I'm just going to, things like, uh, yeah, mashed potato, yeah, potato. Um, greens on toast. Need toast. Nice on toast. Yeah. Sprinkle the cheese on top. Do you put the cheese on top? Um, of I'm actually very allergic to cheese. Oh, yes, yes, yeah. the cheese. That would not be a good idea. Oh, no, which is good. good. So let's just layer it now with smoked salmon. Okay. Yep. Then we're going to roll it up. So, roll no it up. No lemon? We're going to put the lemon after. Because you can leave this in the fridge now just to firm up. If you put the lemon now... We'll start to break down the smoke sound. Just a nice even layer. Even layer. This is the bit you've got to watch though. Okay. <laughs> first of all, we well, roll it first. Right. Roll it first. Roll it first. Yeah. I'll just place this one in the fridge while we're waiting. It'll be fine. That's good. So we just had one in the fridge just to harden up a little bit, just to, you know, so obviously it's been out. That's it. Roll it around. Let's see. You're doing That's brilliant. Awesome. Natural, you see. You natural. are a natural. Right you then. You're having your, having your own restaurant next, aren't you? Yeah. <laughs> Just doing, just for doing pancakes. Okay. Well, you would be buying a mix, or you be buying everything. Yeah. 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 Why not? You would do anything. Right, let's take You're this right. clean film off. Got a bit of a mess here. Then you can you can cut through the clean film if you really want to. But we're going to. Move. That wouldn't taste very good, though, would it? No, because because <laughs> quite often you leave the clean film on. So we're just going to take a straight knife. What did I do with mine? In let's fuck it. Okay, yeah. stick it in the fridge. And we're just going to cut this. Cut this soon. Oh, that's. Yeah, me. Yeah, that that's looks it. good. That's it. Nice. Oh, that looks great, Bryn. I'm just going to stand them all up. I'm stick them over here on the nice plate. I'm just going to dress it with a little bit of leaves. And that is it. That it's like is... canapé, isn't it? It's like pushed canapé. At the restaurants, we wow. use that as canapé. That is what we do, but for lazy lunch. Yeah, it's a brunch. It's nice and, nice and good. A little bit of seasoning now on top of the so salmon. So what that's would be it. your top tip with this? Top tip, you have to rest the pancake mix, even though guys buys his pancake mix. But if you made it yourself, you have to leave it rest. Well, I, I will say I will never buy another pancake mix. Good luck. Good you see? Now, if you fancy trying your hand at making any of today's dishes, you can get hold of them on our website or you can get them texted straight to your phone. Details are on your screen.